Hello everybody, Phil Squid Turtle here, and welcome to some more adventures into the Talos Principle. Alright, let's get right into this and start solving some puzzles. Since we did everything in the other one. A bit tied up. Okay, you. Jam you. Take this jam. Jam you. This. I'm gonna try to race through some of these. It's a star! And this thing. And let's get open so I don't have to go through it ever again. Yay! Um, well, let's just go around this way. Stashed for later. I don't want to move that until I have a thingy. If you're wondering... Oops, got myself killed. Oh, no, but it's cool. I know where this stuff is just because um, I, I got through a few puzzles and then realized my stuff wasn't working, so I'm going back and getting it right this time. Because I'm still learning and I make mistakes. And... Drop you. Give me this. So I'm going to try to solve all of these. Locked me up and swallowed the key. The, um... There was only one puzzle. Oh. Why am I trying to open them? Of course it's going to be locked. Give me... Oh, let's not go that way. Ooh, keys! Cool, alright. Only one puzzle that gave me any kind of trouble. Which it's I think the next one. So fuck you. Grab this. And that. Take this. Just to be safe, since it likes to do this a lot. I'm gonna just put that there and jam something. I'm gonna do this. And I'm gonna take you. And of course, there was something. Alright, so maybe. I want to get on the walls and run around up there, but it doesn't look like it'll let me. And this guy. This guy freaked the crap out of me. He's just running around. Recording number 23, version 0186. This is apparently what I, I'm going to assume this is what I look like. But yeah, just he, he vanished when I tried to approach him last time. So, I don't know what that... Oh, I gotta go this way. This was the one that g gave me a hard time. I'll show you how how you how I So you do this. Goes up in there. Got that, no problem. Put this here, I tried to grab it through that gap, wouldn't let me. I discovered that if you run all the way over here, pick this up, you can get it. It's like okay, cool. Now I can come over here. And follow these guys who are rotating in opposite directions. Grab these keys. And then I came up here, and I was like, alright, cool. Let me put the keys in here. 
And I couldn't figure out why I only had one, because I need one for that, too. So what you do... I didn't realize this. It took me about a minute. And then you go, bam! And you release this guy? Uh, bam! And he'll go around. I, I, you know, I thought they went in a straight line, but some of them change angles now, if you will. Yeah, okay, that should work. And he goes and he goes over there and he blows that up for us. Oops, and I fall off the stairs. And then I get to come over here and take this nice little red thing, which I have no idea what it does. That was, that was the one I did that took me a bit. And I noticed there are buttons on these pillars. But I have no idea which ones I should be pressing. I discovered some of these later on that don't tell me. That one doesn't give me any information, so I don't know. I don't have a phone that can scan QR codes, so I don't know. Well, generator profile. Or it has been generated. What is my profile? Um, let's display the psychological profile. You may already be criticizing your own performance, but it's clear you understand how the world of ideas affects you. Even if you are sometimes weary with the realities and allow your preferences to dictate your beliefs, you have a great deal of unused capacity which you have not turned to your advantage. Disciplined and self-controlled outside, you tend to be worrisome and insecure inside, but you pride yourself on an independent thinker as an independent thinker and do not accept other statements without satisfactory proof. Now, it's interesting how they generate these cycles. I wonder if it's the same regardless of what choice I make or not. I have no way of knowing. Unless I went all the way back and started a whole new game just for the profile. Um, conflicts. I provided a particular amount of personhood. Or I, I provided a, a particular account of personhood, but was uncomfortable with its implications. Users sought to maximize both liberty and quality of life, but these ideals are incompatible. User had inconsistent ideas about value. My account privileges. I only have basic account privileges, which means I cannot do this. And I logged a support ticket. And, um... Account certification error. I, I don't know what these things do, so I clicked on one, and thank you, and then, okay, I guess I'll exit. And then it loads up the, the, the datas that are on this that we already read. It's cool, right? Yeah. Uh, sorry to rush through that. I am. Um, first, let's go build this. This is where I haven't been. Well, at least not this way. Cool. Ah, ha! There we go. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give That's somewhat frightening, not gonna lie. Hey, wait, no, no, no. There is I mean... much that you may learn in the halls of my temples, for there is much that you do not know. That is why you are a child. But children are made to learn and in time they come to have dominion over the lands of their home. So it shall be with you and your generations. I need a bunch of stars. So. Um... Let's complete this one. It's an interesting idea that... based on what you know... is what determines... If you're... I mean, you don't know much, so therefore, you are a child. Rather than it being based on age, it's based you on have how proven you know. yourself worthy, child. Oh, good. And this gate shall be forever open also to good. you. Also good. Seek now the other worlds I have given you, that you may attain even greater mastery, and bring glory to your kind. But remember... You must not ascend the Great Tower, for it shall bring death 
and the end of your generations. This tower? This must be the great tower that I'm not allowed to ascend. I, um... My, my gaming experience tells me there's a, nice, a lot of nice loot up there. Well... Well, um... He said I can't ascend the tower, so I can, I can go into it, right? I'm afraid of that tower. There's something terrible inside it. Never think about it. Don't even look at it. Just focus on doing the work. This must be the tower we were warned about. Seems the upper levels are locked tight. Elohim is taking no chances that we stray from his path. Sheep. The other one was seer and the other one was sheep. Said I may not ascend the Great Tower, but it looks like I can. I mean... I can just open this and explore all this. I'm just gonna... I'm gonna pretend it doesn't exist for now. Ooh, wait. What are these? On returning from the tower, I felt a great tiredness. And an... And an enormous energy. What I now know disturbs me, but I hope that by living with this knowledge, I might provide a shoulder for you. The Giants of Tomorrow. Shepherd. The view from the top must be incredible. Huh. Interesting. Well, let's get interact with this computer because once we finish, he'll save the game. Because that's what the computers do. Um. 12. The Council of Zeus. Ambersand 41, 53, uh, pound 4345, 4E, 44, 20, 4F, 4C, 59, 4D, 50, 55, 53. The great bronze bulls pulled the carriage forward, mighty bursts of steam issuing from their nostrils. Finally, they came to the gates at the top of the... something. User dot set. Pound 43. Pound 48, 49, pound 4C, 44, 20, percent 4F, 46, 25A, 45, 5, 5, 3. Here assembled were all the many generations of the gods and demigods and souls of mortals, steel and bronze and iron and memory of flesh. The clouds parted far beneath, revealing the beautiful plains of Macedon, where great gleaming cities had once... Pound 5, 3, 6. Okay. Let's talk about Rome. Uh, Professor Dr. Armin Hulak. The fall of the Roman Empire. A dialectical approach. Uh, some gibberish caption. Homo sum humani nihil a mi alenium puto. I don't know my Latin, so I don't know what that means. But, interesting as such perspectives of the decline and, all, and ultimate dissolution of the Roman Empire may be, they ultimately put too much emphasis on individual catastrophic events. The real question that must be asked is why the Roman Empire, which had dealt with so many threats and catastrophes over the years, was so incapable of responding to these later problems. We must investigate the division of wealth, the structure of government, the location of power in Roman society. Had the Republic survived or been restored, would Rome still have fallen? What was the role of debt and slavery in creating the conditions for what we now call the Dark Ages? Rome, the saying goes, was not built in a day. It didn't fall in a day either. To register for the class, please email 3 Ambersands. <laughs> and so this, all right. Well, we found the Great Tower. And I'm slightly tempted to go up there, because I kind of want to know. I mean, big old stormy clouds and all that. But we'll see how long I can resist, how many puzzles I can solve before I give up and go up there. Maybe the game will eventually make me go up there. Or maybe there's a different ending. Maybe if I don't ever go up the tower, I get a completely different ending. Don't know. Something I want to mention is the terrain, though. This is, like, isolated. Like, I'm up in the mountaintops where no one's gonna find me. Alrighty. That's all I have. So thank you all for watching. Hope you have a great day. And maybe I'll see you in the next video. Toodaloo!